So we're here today in the aftermarket support facility or the ASF, part of Engine Overhaul Services. What is special about what we're doing here in this facility is that it has been specifically created to incorporate the new Trent 1000 HP turbine blade, which of course doubles the time on wing of that product. So the Trent 1000 went into service in 2011 and has been a fantastic product from a reliability perspective but now we're really excited to give it the durability that our customers need. This moment is the culmination of lots of hard work from so many people from right across the business, from the sales team to engineers, to operational facilities, to planners. It's really an exciting time. Of course, Rolls-Royce has invested heavily in developing the modification that we're gonna put into the Trent 1000. But of course, we've also invested hugely in MRO capacity here in Derby is just one of a number of sites that are either new or expanded as part of our MRA capacity growth all across the globe, from Asia to Europe to the Americas, and there is more coming. Engine Overhaul Services, we call it the lead shop because we're here in Derby, the home of Rolls-Royce Civil Aerospace, surrounded by thousands of engineers, so we get to learn together in the MRO space and we share that knowledge across the globe. In the aftermarket support facility, we've recruited over 100 people in 12 months such that we can run at this modification as, as quickly as possible. When the Trent 1000 went into service in 2011, Engine Overhaul Services in Derby, we were the launch shop for that programme. So we have a lot of experience doing the Trent 1000 and there's a lot of passion and pride in that product. Of course, what is paramount for our customers is that we give them their engines back as quickly as possible to maintain fleet health. And we are confident in quick turn times because we've been performing HP turbine blade swaps in this facility since we opened it at the start of the year. So we're now ready to bring in the new blade standard with confidence that we can give a really, really good turn time at the right levels of, of quality and of course product safety. Of course, supply chain constraints have been a feature of this industry for the last few years, but we have confidence in supply of new HP turbine blades for this programme as we were fully expecting certification, so we've been building up a stockpile and we are now ready to go. We have pulled out all the stops and we are absolutely laser focused on rolling out this modification as quickly as possible for our customers. Everybody at Rolls-Royce recognises the disruption that our customers have experienced, but that just adds to our determination to get this right. And all of my team, and I know the wider Rolls-Royce, are determined to make the Trent 1000 the engine of choice for the 787.